So this is a demo of the content server migration tool. So what you see in front of you here is a list of 11 files that we want to move from the Health Canada prescription drug folder within our network drive onto the open text content server. As you can see, the content server is empty or the folder within content server is empty. So what we'll do is we'll pull up our migration tool. There are two areas we need to input and then also our username and password. We can start with the source UNC path. So this is the folder you wanna take the information out of. You can enter the UNC path a couple different ways. You can paste it in as we've done here and then navigate through the folders. This is a bit of a shortcut instead of having to navigate through all of your folders. So we'll select our folder there. And then if we try to insert the node ID, as it shows here, you have to enter your username and password first before being able to browse content server. That's obviously for permissioning issues. You can select remember username and password if you don't want to input it each time. So now if we go back to browse, you'll see all of your folders coming out from content server. So you can select the appropriate folder by navigating through. Another option, as you can see, there's the node ID, which is 87652. If you have Content Server already opened up in a web browser, you can actually just paste the node ID from the URL there into the box. And now that we have all of our information input, we'll just click Start. And there's a little progress bar at the bottom. So we're crawling the information that's been completed. And now we're migrating it into Content Server. So we'll let that load there. It says it's been successfully processed. We'll just refresh our Content Server. And there we go. We have our documents. 11 items have been input. And then you would just repeat that task as many times as you need to. And that's it.